Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Pinky and today I will talk about the B8 sound card. Actually, bagong bili ko lang to. And binili ko siya para dito sa condenser mic to uh, to connect to my MacBook Air. So, yung MacBook Air ko is 2020 version or edition. And I tried the TRRS splitter as suggested by other people pero hindi ko siya napagana so i decided to buy this v8 sound card and it worked so that's one of the things na gusto kong i-share sa inyo and also um gusto ko rin i-share ano yung features nitong v8 sound card and then yun nga how to set it up with your macbook air if like me your uh MacBook Air is the 2020 edition. So, simulan na natin. So, let me show you um, how the V8 sound card looks like. I'm sure some of you already know. No? Um, so, ito yung mga functions niya. And then, sa likod, that's where you see the different ports where you will connect your um, accessories or devices. Like here, the dynamic mic that's usually the mic that you use when you uh when you sing sa video okay and then there's a port specifically for condenser mic like this one and then may dalawang port dyan earphone speaker and headset so any of those you can connect your earphones and then meron siyang charging port if you charge if you want to charge the sound card and then accompaniment Ito daw yung for, I think ito yung ginagamit ng mga singers, musicians. So, yung music nila. Um, ako, hindi ko naman yun talaga kailangan. Wala pa akong planong maging singer as of now. And then, merong live 1 and live 2. And this is where you connect uh, either your phone or your laptop. Sa ibang um, sound card, ang nakalagay dyan, phone 1 and phone 2. So, yon And then, very important is the power button. So, ito sa sobrang excitement ko. Akala ko hindi gumagana. Hindi ko pala na on. So, uh, you have to press it for a few seconds. And then, yun. So, working naman siya. And so, ngayon, what we'll do is, I'll uh, uh, show you the connections or how to set it up. Ah, but before that, when you buy this sound card pala, it, uh, it has three chords dapat together with it. So, yung isang chord is the charging port. So, ito yon. This is what you connect to the charging port. And then, ito yung sa USB. Tapos, meron siyang dalawang port na ganito for the uh, phone or laptop. So, it's a TRRS uh, 3.5 jack port. And then, ganito yung kabilang dulo niya. Ito naman, that's what you connect to the sound card. Okay, so for the condenser mic, um, actually very easy lang yung setup eh. So, so, ito yung dulo ng or audio jack ng condenser mic ko. And then, I'll just plug it here. So, yan. And then, if I want to check if it's working, I can um, connect. So, I'll try to connect my earphone dito sa earphone speaker. Yan. So, kahit dalawa pa lang silang ganyan. And then, your earphones. And then, I'll, I want to listen to it. Malalaman natin kung mag-work. Kasi, when you listen to uh, using your earphone, ayan, naririnig ko na na... Um, it sounds like a mic. Ngayon, yung isa pang kaeng-engan ko rin, you have to make sure that the monitor, this one, that the monitor is, uh, ayan. So, i-rotate nyo siya to the right so that you can hear the the mic. Kasi kung nandito siya, naka-zero siya dyan eh. So, you can't hear anything. And you feel like sira yung V8 mo. Pero actually, hindi siya sira. You just need to uh, ayan, increase the volume of the headset. So, this this monitor is 
for you to hear the sound of your mic. So, ayan, pag nilakasan ko, ayan, oh, naririnig ko yung mic. Later on, I'll, I'll let you hear the the sound of the mic when I connect it to the laptop and then I will record. So, yun, very important yung monitor for you to to see. So, just with this two set up, uh, you can already check if your V8 sound card is working and Actually, pwede nyo na itong pag, paglaroan eh. Itong mga different functions like, yan o. Oh, if you press clap, yan. So, yun. I can hear a clapping sound. So, later, ipaparinig ko sa inyo yan. So, anyway. So, that's the basic setup. So, ngayon naman, we'll try to connect this to my laptop. To see if it really works and I'll show you it talaga nag work siya. So what we'll do is connect the this um, cable to either live 1 or live 2. Pero live 2 na lang. Yun ang feel ko eh. Pero kahit saan pwede talaga. So dyan. And then the other um, side, yung audio jack, we'll connect it to the laptop. So, how do we know if it works? So, we'll open the system preference and then audio or sound. And we will see, ito sa output, kita na nga siya, the external headphones. And then sa input, nandun din siya. So, external mic. Ngayon, if, for example, i-unplug natin siya. Ayan, wala. Hindi natin makikita yung uh, external mic or external headphone. But, if we plug it, ayan, so, there. So, kita natin na na-detect siya. Kasi, before when I tried yung uh, TRRS splitter, hindi talaga ma-detect. Kahit lagyan ko pa ng headphone yung kabilang side ng splitter, ayaw. Hindi ko alam kung bakit. So, um, baka sa akin lang. <laughs> or, maybe, hindi ko alam, basta maarte ito si Mac. So, anyway, we will test the mic. I'll let you hear the sound. Um, we'll open an app. It's called Audacity. Okay, it, this is a free app. So, pwede nyong i-download if you feel like you know you want to use it for editing so here in the in the app um you will see dun sa settings ayan um yung mic niya naka default na siya or na detect na niya we will use the external mic and then yung speaker niya is the external headphones or you can also change that to max speakers para medyo um, makita nyo yung sound. So, ipapakita ko. Okay, so, we will do a test. We will record. Start recording. Sound check. Sound check. Testing. One, two, three, four. Sound check. Sound check. Okay, so, that's the proof that it's recording. Ayan. You can see Ayan, oh. And then, paparinig ko sa inyo, ito yung recording. Sound check, sound check, testing, 1, 2, 3, 4, sound check, sound check. Okay, so, very uh, clear naman yung, yung recording niya. Um, let's discuss the different functions of this V8 sound card. Based on ilang days kong use itong sound card, what I noticed is that if I record while it's charging, merong noise dun sa recording ko. So, what I do is, charge ko muna and then after charging, I can use it. Pero, if I use this and while charging it, kunyari, ang ginagawa ko naman is a voice call over the internet like a messenger call or well, sa messenger ko pa lang naman na-try. 
walang noise yung ano yung voice ko pero yun nga pag nagre-record ako like here in Audacity I record while charging merong noise so it's better to do the recording na fully charged na yung sound card nyo okay and also um di ba meron siyang dalawang port earphone speaker and headset I observed na when I put the earphone yung earphone lang siya talaga dito sa headset it's not working so wala akong naririnig in the monitor but when i tried yung headset ko dito the one with the uh, earphones and mic it's working so yun yung importante so like this one um earphones lang siya talaga wala siyang mic so that's what i put here sa earphone speaker and then ayan if i listen to it ayan naririnig ko yung um yung sound ng mic. I can hear the sound of the mic. And then, dito naman sa kabila, headset talaga kailangan. So, yung headset, meron siyang mic, and meron siyang earphone. So, kahit ano sigurong klase, basta headset siya. Yun yung ilalagay natin dito. Yan. So, dun siya. Sa headset talaga na port. And then, I'll try to listen. Yan, naririnig ko yung yung mic in the monitor. Okay, so ngayon naman, let's talk about the different functions or features of this V8 sound card. So, number one is yung mic. So, this is the volume for the mic. So, syempre, pag nando siya sa minimum, yan, wala kang marinig, pero ayan, ako in-increase ko na lang to the max, yung mic. And then, katabi niya is the echo. So, kung gusto mo may echo, malakas yung echo mo, when you record or when you do something live, ganyan. Pero ako ayoko. So, set it to minimum. Hindi naman siya talaga zero echo, pero minimum na echo. And then, ito naman, treble and bass. I think ito, mas nakakaalam nito yung mga musicians or singers. Yan. They will adjust through this. Ayan. Ikot-ikot din yan. And then, yung record. So, sinet ko siya na to the max kasi para malakas yung recording ko. Um, and then, music, ito, syempre, kung meron kang music na nakakabit dito sa, ano, diba, sa accompaniment, pero, so, naka-lowest lang siya sa akin, or minimum, kasi hindi ko naman talaga yung gagamitin masyado. And then, yung monitor, yun, nabanggit ko na kanina, for the earphones, para marinig mo yung, yung sarili mo, or yung whatever uh, you've connected to the sound card dito yon sa monitor. So, adjust mo na lang ganyan. Siyempre, ako dito lang, medyo dyan lang para di naman ako mabingi. And then, ito, nakakatuwa itong mga functions na to. Okay. So, ngayon, naririnig niyo yung voice ko from the microphone. So, ito yung recording ko now from the V8 sound card. Ngayon, i-continue natin yung features na sinasabi ko kanina. So, isa-isahin natin. Like, this one, yung electro eto yan. Yan yung effect ng electro. Hindi ko alam kung may effect talaga. Parang hindi masyadong noticeable. And then, ito so, maganda to. Yung pitch blend. So, ayan. Maririnig nyo. Nag-change yung voice ko. Diba? And then, may isa pa siyang variation. Okay. So, ito yung isa pang voice niya sa pitch blend. Dalawa lang naman sila. So, nakakaaliw lang gamitin. Ito naman yung sa elimination. And then, ito naman yung sa shockwave. Akala ko dati shockwave. Shockwave pala. I'm not sure kung may difference. And then, ito yung MC na voice. So, siguro ito kung feel mo maging MC. <laughs> And then, ito yung dodge. Yung dodge, hindi ko rin masyadong ma-distinguish ano yung difference niya. And then, itong iba naman are the sound effects that you can use, no? When you go live or you do, parang may gusto nyo ng sound effect sa recording nyo. Like, this one is the cheer. Okay, and then, embarrass. And then, kung may gusto kayong barilin, gun. And then, ito naman, despise. Ito naman, debut or debut. I like it, I love it, I want some more of it. Yan. Tapos, kung gusto nyo may tatawa sa jokes nyo, yun lang. 
and then clap. Okay, and then meron ding pay attention. Ding, ding, ding. Tapos merong isa pang uh, kiss. Yan, yan, yung medyo mahaba. And then meron dalawang songs. Song 1. And song number 2. Yun. So, yan. So, narinig nyo, yun yung mga iba-ibang klaseng uh, features and sound effects from this V8 sound card. So, that's how to set up the V8 sound card to a MacBook Air 2020 and also those are the features of this sound card. So, I'm happy for purchasing this sound card kasi number one, it worked for my Mac na gumana yung condenser mic na binili ko. <laughs> and then, number two, Natuwa ako kasi marami siyang features or functions that I can use later on in the future. Sa ngayon, hindi, hindi masyado pero I plan to use them in the future. And if you're planning to buy the V8 sound card, so maganda research then if it's compatible with your device, if it works. I think it works in most smartphones nowadays and also in Windows PC laptop. With MacBook, ano eh, iba-iba yata, I think, ha? Kasi some of the videos I watched, um, kinoconnect nila dun sa charging port and then dun sa Mac, sa USB port ng Mac. Pero I tried it with my my laptop, hindi siya gumana. So what worked is, yun nga, connect it to the, yung Live 1 or Live 2 and then to the audio jack of the laptop. That's my video about the V8 sound card. I hope you learned something from it. And if you like this video, please hit the like and subscribe button. And I do some tech videos. Not all the time, but pag meron akong natututunan, I try to um, teach it also to others. And I also have travel videos about mga personal trips ko naman yon. I also have prayer videos. Um, if you want to um, take some time to pray, you can also check out my channel. So, thank you so much and please don't forget to subscribe. Bye!